This is the final piece of the newsletter. We need to put a heading on the second page and in order to do that we first of all need to put a section break in because the heading needs to be in one column and we currently have three columns. Under page layout and breaks we're going to put a continuous break here and then above that break is, let's see if I can get above it, Okay, I'll try this. Above this we're going to put it back into one column. Good. And then we want to put the title Health Bits and that's going to be in our green heading style that we have created and center it. Beneath that we're going to simply copy from the first page this much of our heading put that on the second page. Alright, if it comes in like mine did, uh, I need to take off the border at the top. And if it came in as a custom, I'll just take the border off the top and see if I can get it to work. Nope, I wasn't in the right place. Let me try that again. Here we go. Take it off the top. And then underneath that heading on the second page, we're going to copy this heading. and for some reason it didn't come in with the green so we'll take it back there. We're not going to center it though. And then our next thing we're going to put right before that is continued from first page. And that is going to be in italics. And we're going to bring in a document or copy something else from Word. And in order to do this, we're just going to open up this other document. And it will be on your shared U drive in Cox Word Processing. This is Chapter 6. And it's called the High End Eye and Hand and Eye Chart. I'll get this right. And you can see that it is a smart art graphic. And we're going to change it a little bit. So we go in through the design up here. And this is the one we want so that it just has the headings up there in the blue. Uh, we're going to actually put in another heading and it's going to be out one, so let me move it out one. I won't take to eat lunch in there anymore now. Hold on the brain.